first Filipino-built Roro will make its maiden voyage next week, plying the Matnog Allen port route. The shipbuilder says the vessel is equipped with modern systems, making her safer and easier to monitor. Let's find out more from Greg Gregorio. The MV Isla Simara passenger ship prides herself as the first Roro vessel that was built in the Philippines. She sits 480 passengers and can take in 16 buses. Her builders say she's equipped with modern systems that enables the head office to monitor her condition even when she's sailing. She's also the first Roro ship with a marine evacuation system, a life-saving device similar to an airplane's evacuation chute. It is actually compliant to all the latest uh, marine regulations as well as international maritime organization uh, rules and regulations for passenger ferries. Maritime safety has been a tricky situation in the country's domestic routes. At least 30 people died when three wooden outrigger boats flipped in the waters between Iloilo and Gamaras a few weeks back. Authorities have since shut down the operations of wooden boats in the two provinces. The Transportation Department has since urged Roro vessels to augment the Iloilo Gimaras route. Now it's time for the uh, private sectors you know, to contribute to the modernization. MV Isla Simara is named after a small island in Romblon. It was built out of imported materials and it took two years to complete construction at a shipyard in Navotas. The Philippine Registry of Shipping assures passengers that the vessel passed marine safety standards. For the safety of the passengers, so they are, they are, they are sure that uh, the vessel is safe for the passenger. Starting next week, she will serve the Allen Matnog route. Three other Roro vessels are also being built in Pangasinan. They're expected to enter service by next year. It shows that uh, we can build better, uh, better and better because uh, we continuously learn and learn. For News 5, Greg Gregorio, We Are One News.